So welcome back and thank you so very much for joining. I still thoroughly appreciate the dedication. Thank you. Okay, well, I did not expect it to start right away. But it did. So let's see where that little passageway led to. Uh oh. This is creepy. No. Revelio. I did. I just hit Revelio. Nothing popped up. Is, am I supposed to practice on him? Cause that's what that normally means. That's odd. Why would someone store one hat in here? An elf-sized hat. That's not very hospitable. Now I have to attack him. Oh goody! Someone to play with. You seem brave, smart. What fun this will be! For me. Okay, I'm scared. What the fuck is going on? Revelio. Lumos. So do I have to do something with That's the mannequins? The... Onwards, I suppose. Oh. Guess it randomly just popped up. All right, well. Oh what? shit! Who's that? God. <sighs> oh, that scared the shit out of me. Oh, okay. What are you gonna do to me now? Are you gonna go to the ceiling? Oh, that feels weird in my ears. Those dang footsteps. Take me over here, please. Oh, that's weird. Bats. Lovely. Oh, yay, puzzles. Revelio. Do I have to do Reparo hmm. on you? Seems as if I should hang something there. Something, see if I could hang something? These lanterns must belong somewhere. Lanterns? Good for you. Are you a lantern? Oh, you're a mirror. What lantern? Perhaps the lanterns oh. are meant to be hung on the hands. Oh! He thinks that. He just said that they're supposed to be hanging on the hands. Okay, you looked everywhere in this room except for the other two areas. What? Okay, so it's not those ones, so it's gotta be these ones over here. No, there's lamps. What the hell? You looked at it again. What from here? Well, I can't jump. 
Am I just supposed to bring that table closer? There we go. How enlightening! Who is this creepy person? You might survive a bit longer than the other. Ooh, that's ooh. What's going on? Oh, you've come so far, so quickly. Well done. You might be just the playmate I've been looking for. I do hope you enjoy my playground. I encourage you to tell everyone about it, if you make it out, that is. Please try. If you get to the end, perhaps we can come to some sort of arrangement. I do want your shop to succeed, after all. Oh, my saying? fighting. Two sides to every storm. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, both sides here are to my story. Oh. You have to complete both to get to the end. I simply adore this blooming place. Don't you? Yes, just get me out of here. The foliage, like most living things, what will honey? survive for long in the darkness. Okay. I wonder if I need to place lanterns to open these doors. No, I know. I saw the two hands. I just gotta find the lanterns. They gotta be, yes, I agree. Revelio. Okay. I just heard a big thump and I thought that was the door opening, my bad. What if it is it over here? Okay, there's another one. Okay, nothing over there. Whoa, hello. There it is. Should I take it over to the door? Yeah, because I was able to go downstairs at this point, but now I can't. So it has to be this way, right? Will this do anything if I do that? Nope, okay. Through here. What's this? A game with the Oh! Knight's Wizard's chest. chest. Chess. I can't play chess for shit. <laughs> Am I supposed to play? Sh Am I supposed to play chess? That was the wrong square. So I am playing. Okay, well, at Number least I know it's this one. On the board indicate where I can't go. What if you go like there? Nope, not that one. Perhaps I can find a way to reveal the path. Okay. 
Okay, so there's the ones that are cracked. I know. Revelio. You mean like there? You mean like this? Wasn't too difficult. Oh goodness! <laughs> I do hope you're having as much fun as me. I think I'll keep you around a bit longer. Okay, another lantern somewhere. I supposed to bring that one from the other side. Is there one over here? Okay, it's in this room somewhere. Do I have to, do I have to do? Ha ha! Aha! Come on. I did it. Let's go in this room. Okay, where is the hand? Okay. We got in Leviosa. And then go left or right? I gotta go right, right? Is the other one back in the other room? So it's in this room with me. Revelio. Is that it right there? Mm -hmm. Oh, I okay. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. How am I going the wrong way? I can easily come in and grab this one, can I? Oh, that's not creepy. Holy doors! Oh, I'm afraid of the dark! Does it worry you that I can see you, but you can't see me? We got you, let me Oh shit. Hmm, I Lewis. got you a seat, but I'm rearranging the furniture. Plus, don't want you getting too comfortable for what's in store, do I?
Okay, I see what I have to do now. That one. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. And then. Just walk around and go grab it. Just go around this way. We got the Leviosa. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Well, what am I supposed to hit him with? Confringo? is creeping me out. Lumos. So we have to go this way. And I heard you, baby, I promise.
boss fight. If you give me two Wigan Wills, it's a boss fight. I thought it was one of those ricochet things like the trolls. Anything else want to jump out and scare me? Good, because I gotta go change my shorts. You didn't tell me this game was scary, honey. I know what I'm naming this video now. Five more Wigan Welds? Thank you. Ah, you've chosen the scholarly route. You'll need more than you've learned from books to best me. Got a lantern. It's around here somewhere. Revelio. No, I know. It's always good to have a different perspective. Oh. We got the Leviosa. Revelio. We got the Leviosa. I'm not trying to act dumb here, I promise. Can I just jump? Uh. That'll be a nope. I don't think so. I can't see anything. We got him at the I can't grab it. Then I gotta go to another way then, right? If I can't go that way, there's gotta be another way. Like, AKA down the stairs. Yep, I see it. And then I have to bring it all the way back upstairs. Is that where I'm supposed to go with it?
I just, I, I'll just leave it right there. Left. Okay, it's cool. So no, I'll just leave it right there then. I don't know why the door opened. We got in the What's going on with my controller? That's what I did. It's analog, yeah. My head is spinning. Mean that way? Oh yeah, and those make steps. Revelio. I was gonna say there's not really anywhere else for me to go. Okay, there's the lantern. Oh. So it looked like a candlestick. Should open that. And then let me see if I can at least find the handle first. All books and no pay make one quite dull indeed. Assuming it's up here. I know the lantern's back there. Okay, so then I gotta call it up here. <laughs> Come on, come closer. I see it over there. Come on. Walk this way. Okay, now I need one more. Okay, if you're... Okay. Okay, so it's on this side, yeah? Okay, I got I got you, I got you, baby. Guys, I frustrate him. But I love him. So We're gonna get this. Oh fuck. Just let me through, just let me through. Lumos. Give me Lumos. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Oh, deja vu.
Lumos. Should have hit it. I just trapped in a loop. Hmm. Yeah. Running in circles, are we? Perhaps you should retrace your steps. Lumos. Fuck. Oh, God. Lumos. Don't tell me I'm trapped. Okay, there's gotta be a hidden door somewhere. I do any of that? Lumos. Holy crap! That's not good. Lumos. 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 What is that right? Should I be doing that? Yeah. Getting rid of as many of them as possible just in case. Lumos. Lumos. So. was aiming.
I'll still kill you. When you're done, of course. When you're done. I'm just killing them all just in case. Did I get you all? Home sweet toe. I gotta go back up here, right? Yeah, I got it. I got it, babe. Ooh, sparkly shiny. Oh, more Wigan Welds. Where were you when I needed you in the last couple episodes? I did. What, the Imperial? It does. It. You do it on an enemy and it helps you attack other enemies. Okay. Am I supposed to attack him or? Oh no, I'm just out of furniture. Or not. Now that should get your attention. Well done. I'll give you a moment to collect yourself. If you can. Ta ta for now. Return to the foyer. Come on, foyer just sounds more fancier. Foyer. Oh yay, more, 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 more fun. Oh, he's in back outside. Uh oh. No! Oh, I don't want to deal with the boss. Aha! Finally! You, my inordinately clever friend, appear to have traversed this seemingly never ending dungeon relatively unscathed. And now I suppose you'll want to go. Everyone leaves me, usually in a straitjacket, never to return. I'm starting to take it Hopefully. personally. I'm tired of having no one to play with. Ooh. Ooh. Tell you what, I'll make you a deal. If you can match wits with me now, and you agree to give me unfettered access through the shop for, say, one day a month to have a little fun, I'll sign a contract. Pursue it to which, um, uh, let me see, I will... Blah, 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 I can blah, make blah, him, blah. I can sign oh, the contract. Yes, uh, leave you and your customers alone at all other times, etc, etc. You get your shop, I get my chaos. Sound acceptable? Excellent! <laughs> Let the games begin! Or I don't get a fucking choice. That's what I pressed. That was that's what I pressed. Bombarder. 
Can I do the same thing like a troll? Just made out of furniture. I have him under Imperial right now. Oh, this is not fair. so meticulously crafted. Such a treat to have fun again in my little dungeon. I wouldn't call it fun, really. Wouldn't you? Hmm. To each their own, I suppose. So, about the contract? I am a poltergeist of my word. Very well. I shall agree to your contract with one small addendum. No more of this unsatisfying banging about all day in a pitiful void. Wait, did you say one small addendum? I did. In order that I have a successful shop with lots of customers, would you agree to causing chaos only after nine o'clock in the evening? Hmm. Hmm. Would you agree to at least two days a month instead of one? I would. Pleasure doing business with you.
You've worn me out. Ah, well done. Oh, I'm done. I have to admit, Cassandra did a wonderful job finding the perfect playmate. At least it's done. And I beat that thing first try. Ha ha ha! Hello, Penny. Oh, Penny, he's so glad you're back. You knew exactly where I was going when I entered that chest. Penny was beginning to think yet another shopkeeper was going to end up in St. Mungo's. Another shopkeeper? St. Mungo's? I think you should explain, Penny. <gasps> Penny, please stop holding your breath. Tell me what's going on. Please forgive Penny. Penny is forbidden from telling you anything. But how can you be forbidden from telling me what's going on? I purchased this shop. I... Penny is confused. Penny thought that if you came back, you would own the shop. Thank you, Penny. I think I'm going to need to talk to the authorities. Oh, Penny is certain that's a brilliant idea. Officer Singer will know what to do. Penny... Okay, now we got to go talk to Officer Singer. Yeah. Where'd Penny go? There she is, she's scrubbing. I have the shop. I own it. How do I not own it yet? I paid her money and everything. She gave me the contract. Officer Singer, I have some information you might be interested in. Ah, good to see you again. What can I do for you? Cassandra Mason sold me her shop and then tried to drive me mad in a haunted dungeon. I... Cassandra Mason sold you her shop. Well, yes, she said she did, but I think you might have missed the bit about the dungeon. No, no, I, I heard that bit too. And, according to the house elf that came with the shop, she has done this sort of thing before, repeatedly. Hmm. I wondered what was going on. She seems to have had a great deal of trouble keeping a tenant in that shop. In any event, these are serious accusations indeed. Perhaps a little visit with Cassandra is in order to clear this all up. Shall we? Okay, now let's go talk to Cassandra. Looking at where I'm going through the mini map. Yeah, I think so. It's not like I'm doing anything big right now. Not as bad as that creepy dungeon. Hello, Ruth. I see you've met my new tenant. Cassandra, it's my understanding that you sold your shop and your elf to this student. Now they've been telling me some very interesting stories about your business practices. Perhaps you should come with me. <laughs> uh, uh. Stop her! Get her, guys. 
I got eyes on her. I should have known better than to do business with a wild student. Hold on one second, guys. Okay, now we're good. Oh, so she does the same thing. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What the fuck? There we go. What? Dude, take was supposed to be easier. Such a sad excuse for a fight. I'm pressing Protego here. Die, you bitch! Ah, uh, I'm disappointed in you, Cassandra. Incarcerate! You don't know what you're doing! Don't I? I always wondered why you couldn't seem to keep a tenant in that shop of yours. I must admit, the notion of a haunted dungeon never crossed my mind. Thanks for this. You can head back to the shop. Second that hell self of yours, she's probably terrified. Spoony little right to myself! I should have known it was- Silencio. Oh, and not to worry. Cassandra will immediately file the paperwork needed to grant you ownership of both the shop and the elf. On her way to Azkaban. Thank you, Officer Singer. Best of luck to you as the newest shop owner in Hogsmeade. Yay, now it's my shop. No Wigan Wells, nothing? Dang it. Would have been so much better if they did like Wigan Wells and potions instead. Ah, the 
secret is through there. Sounds like she's in the basement, is she? No, she's around the corner. Ha ha ha. Penny, I have what I hope will be good news. Officer Singer confirmed that ownership of the shop has now transferred to me. Oh, well, that is good news. Penny is so relieved. Penny had the most difficult time keeping the truth. I just realized she talks about Penny herself in the third person. To work as hard as she can for such a kind new owner. Should I say that's good to hear instead of freeing her? I look forward to working with you. All that's left is for you to choose a sign for your new shop, and Penny will take care no. of the rest. Because I felt like if she, if I freed her, she would have left and not been the sheep, the shopkeeper. No. You're a dick. I'm sorry. <sighs> Penny, I'm sorry. We're gonna do stitches and drafts. I choose stitches and drafts. Drafts. Excellent choice. Have a look outside. Thank you. I shall work on collecting items for the shops. Oh, I'm a dick. Penny. I'm sorry. We'll be closing the shop by nine o'clock every night. She's a shopkeeper now. I'm sorry. Wishes you safe and wondrous travels. Was that all that was gonna be? Was just the hat? Yeah, she was in the, she was in the hat here too. She's happy still. What are you freaking talking about? No, she literally said I'm, I'm happy. Oh well, the dick is gonna end this video here. So thank you guys so very much for joining. Please have a good day and please have a good night. And always, I'm still hoping you're having a good life. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye, everybody.